Over two years ago, members of Alberta Church of God lost their church home in the April 27th tornado. They've been working to rebuild ever since. Stuart Wilkerson and Chris Booth are here from Alberta Church of God to tell me more about it. Guys, thank you both so much for being with us today. Right, appreciate thank you for having us. Now, I sent our uh, chief photographer, Jerome Davis, over to shoot a little video of where your church is. Yeah. And he came back and he said, Dan, there's nothing there but a concrete slab. Mm -hmm. And that is really where you guys are at yeah. two years later, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. We are. We just started building up the... Uh, just a little bit ago, a couple of days ago, they just started putting up the frame and they saw little cracks in the cement, but they said it was great, but everything's going real good, smoothly, uh, just waiting on the weather, but we're excited. We're so excited to see what God's doing for us. There you go. You hear that, Richard? They're waiting on the weather. So <laughs> any, any day now. All right. Now, guys, you have a, a fundraiser planned for uh, this weekend. It sounds like it's going right. to be fun. Tell us about it. Yeah, if we can get it in in the morning, we're trying. Uh, it's going to be in the morning at 8 to 2. Uh, it's a car show, car truck and bike show. Uh, it's going to have a craft show this year, something for the ladies to look at and, and spend their money on also. Uh, <laughs> there be some activities uh, for the kids, uh, face painting, a bounce house, and uh, things like that. Uh, we'll have a salad auction. Uh, we got some good items this year for the salad auction. Uh, we got a guided hunting uh, trip, uh, guided fishing trip up for sale. Wow, okay. Got some uh, Nick Saban autograph footballs and team autograph footballs. Uh, Maker's Market has been real nice to us from downtown. Uh, they're going to be there for the craft show, and they've donated a lot of stuff for the side auction. A lot of people around town have been good to us this year and stepped up mm -hmm. and donated a lot of good items for our auction. And uh, It's free to spectators, a $20 entry fee for your car, truck, or bike. All the money is going to the proceeds of the furnishings of the of the building this year to buy new stuff for the inside. So we're expecting, hoping good turnout, and hopefully the weather don't deter everybody, you mm -hmm. know, away. But hopefully we can get it in tomorrow. Uh, Richard, you hear that? They want to get it in tomorrow. <laughs> I mean, come on. That's right. He told me the weather's supposed to be out here about mm -hmm. eight o'clock in the morning. It's from eight to two, so hopefully we. You hold him to yeah. that. Hold, hold him yeah. to that. All right. <laughs> and, and if if you want to enter your car, or your motorcycle, it, you can just go up there and do yeah, it. Just the day of, it, right? Day of the okay. show. And uh, if we postpone it, we'll put it on our website or on our Facebook page, and Stuart has mm -hmm. that. So she'll give that out. And, and maybe we can get you back right. up here to let the folks at right. home know too. Guys, thanks so much for being with us today. Thanks. The Truck and Bike Show is on May 4th at Davis Emerson Middle School. That's in Cottondale. You can find out more by calling 205-292-7825.